Test, test, test. Okay. Da -da -da -da. Da -da -da -da. Yeah, it's working. <laughs> so fucking full. This is gonna be the chillest fucking stream I will have ever done. Maybe. Probably not. It's probably not true. Is that right? Yeah, it's right. <laughs> Excuse me if I start snorting everywhere and I sound kinda tired. I just got back from uh eating a lot of fucking meat. Like this meat was fucking this meat was fucking so hard. It the friction burns just cooked it all. Like holy fuck, this meat was good. Good shit. Good 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 shit. Anyways. Oh no. Okay, dokie. Time for absolutely nothing to happen. Like nothing at all. This is gonna be a chill stream. So if you're actually expecting something, it's like the place for you, my friend. Oh, and uh, for anyone curious, this isn't the first time I played this game, but the first part of this, since I'm gonna label this too, it was an older update, plus it's probably not worth looking at. <laughs> it, it was really old. A lot of things have changed so far. This is update 14. Right? Oh, I can't check from here. Oh well. But yeah. Um, I guess I'll just show you around. This is 7 Days to Die, Cribs Edition. This is what I call the Sentry Post. This is where you look out. Even though the zombies probably usually always fucking spawn behind you for some damn reason. I was seeing every single horde night I've gotten they spawn behind that house. Like barely any come from this side. Uh, this is like a makeshift campfire. I put a hatch there so no one falls into the fucking thing because I've done that several times. This is supposed to be the well where you can get water. As you can clearly see there's a uh, living water down there in the corner. But uh I don't think you can scoop it up. Oh, actually, I should mention that. Um, before update 14, I think, you were able to glitch out the water. So the reason why this is so small is because I didn't expect the water to actually uh, lower. Every single time you get water from this, the water disappears. Like with glass jars or buckets. Before the changes, that didn't happen. So you can just... You could have just thrown down some water here and then scoop it up infinitely with glass jars or something. As long as you didn't use a bucket, you'd be fine, but they changed that. Uh, this is my little um, safe house. There's two sides. Like I mentioned before, the zombies for every horde invasion, they usually come from this side. And then I uh, whoop their asses right here. This whole part... Oh, what did I just say? The, oh, this whole part right here... This little box here, it has not fallen. And as you can see, I reinforced the fuck out of it, so it doesn't fall for sure. But, um, my days reset for the server, so I'm not sure what happened, but I probably won't be encountering, uh, police anytime soon. I have encountered dogs, though, and like I mentioned before, I whooped their asses. And then this is my, uh, humble abode. Extra security measures, another fucking door here, because I love doors. Knock knock, who's there? Nobody, because I'm the only one here. And this is my little hovel. I made it look like I had a ventilation system going on here, because obviously I don't want to die from my own cooking. You know? Like, who the fuck would want to? That'd be awful. That'd be awful. This is all my stuff. Got some engines there. Yeah, there's nothing else to see here. Okay. Uh, this is a friend's bedroll. I don't know why she put it there. I still don't know why I asked that before. But, uh, yeah. Whatever. You can sleep where she pleases. That hatch isn't very safe, though, but then again, this part is. It's fine. Uh, you probably can't tell, but, uh, I, like, double reinforce the walls here. So, it's not just scrap blocks. It's also scrap panels, like reinforced panel sidings. I don't think I upgraded these yet. Wait, did I? 
No, I didn't. Wait. Do I need... Oh. Forged iron. Oh, God. Oh, forged iron. Oh, God. Forged iron. Sorry. <laughs> when I'm tired and or... Sl no. It's basically the same thing. I'm just saying the same fucking thing to him because I'm a redundant piece of shit. Whenever I'm full or tired, I usually just kind of lose restrictions on my uh, mouth. <laughs> uh, I could have worn that way better, but I didn't. Fuck me, anyways. Okay, what I wanted to do was reinforce this one side? Where is it? Oh. Hmm. Can I get it from there? Wait, no, this one there. There it is, that's this side. Ah, fuck, god damn it. Uh, I don't know where else I can go for scrap slash iron. It's not really in good supply here. I've like, I've almost like bled this whole neighborhood dry. Like I've, I've taken down a lot of cars, a lot of air conditioners. I, I just don't have enough fucking metal. So annoying. I just want to build while having, uh, you know, a reasonable amount of difficulty trying to survive and shit. Can I just ask for that? Ask for that. I can't. I can't. Um. Hmm. Oh, it's almost dark. Let's see. I got four, four more days until the next horde. Which. Technically, isn't really true. I don't know what it did, but I shut down the server to restart the computer. Like, I have a server computer that I host this world on. And then, I don't know what happened, but when I brought it back up and then went inside the game, it... The days reset. I'm not sure why. But I ain't complaining. <laughs> Fuck the police. Jesus. I'd rather not deal with military or police zombies anytime soon. I just want to chill. It's kind of annoying, you can't really alter that or edit it. Like, they don't give you an option to just kind of tone down on those, those scripted hordes. I just don't know why. It doesn't seem like it's a bad thing to give the player that much freedom, you know? But it's like, nope, they just don't let you. Anyways, let's see. Oh, wait a minute, actually. Ooh, boy. Oh, God. Ah, oh, Jesus. My friend marked a cave, like, all the way west over there. But it's really fucking far. So I'm just gonna... I'm just gonna chill around here still. There should be plenty of stuff to scavenge still. Just gotta look for it. Yes, this is the kind of music... This is the kind of music to listen to while I'm trying to survive night to night. In the middle of a zombie infested world. Yes. Really calming. But um, this this music might calm me so much that I'll lounge. And no one wants to lounge in a zombie infested world. Because that means I get a beach chair, a pina colada, and a 401k, and then I'm set, but I'm not. Money means nothing in this world. You can't lounge in this world. It's too busy. Gotta run. Gotta get shelter. Gotta. I guess I'll just build a fort with all that money. <laughs> what the fuck are you talking about? I don't know. Well, actually, it's, it's an inside joke. It'd be kind of. I have long to actually explain it, actually. I think. I don't feel like explaining it right now, though. <laughs> Oh yeah, this is funny. For some reason, uh, the wrench works on the toilet. I'm not sure why. Ooh! Oh, nice. Well, how did... Huh. I guess no one checked her. Okay, that's cool. A call... Oh, wow. A claw hammer is gonna be nice. What do you mean you don't understand redeemed? What do you mean it's been a while, bro? Oh. Oh yeah, it has been a while. 
funny. Yeah, how you been, man? It's been a while. Yeah. Nice. Nope. Oh. All right. Okay. Nope. Wait. Hope you've been doing okay, redeemed. That's been a while. <laughs> And again, I don't really blame anyone who doesn't really come here often, it's fine. Not really that entertaining anyways. <laughs> All I do is play video games. What is this song? What am I listening to? Oh shit, wait a minute. Wait a minute. Uh oh. No, that's not what I want. God damn it, window capture, you fuck. That's... I should've looked at that before. I had to have that, uh, song ticker on. I feel kinda bad. It's, I think it's maybe been like a song or two since that... Since I put up the window capture. Well, you switched the build to your sister, or... Guardianship. Like, are you... Is she your guardian, or are you her guardian? But man, it sounds like you had internet troubles, and that sucks. I can feel you on that part, at least. My internet is still acting up. I'm not even sure if I'll be able to stream as much as I, as long as I want to tonight, because uh, my internet's been acting that crazy. It sucks, but you know, Jesus. I can't really yell at them, because uh, they told me there was an outage nearby, and usually what they say is, Oh! We've found out that there's an outage near you. Sorry, you gotta wait until that's fixed before you can start complaining again. It's like, fuck you guys, Jesus Christ, man. And I get enough trouble with this ISP, so I was like, what the fuck? Oh, she took custody of you, Redeem, okay. 150 megabytes per second? Is that, is that just pure download speed, or do you have any upload speed? That still sounds good, if I'm doing my calculations right. I mean, if you had kilobytes per second, that'd be awful. <laughs> that'd be like god awful. <laughs> right. Oh, missed it. Yeah. We're eating harder tonight. Oh no, get that. No, I'm not gonna eat plants. I ain't healthy. Yeah, it sounds pretty good, Redeemed, if you're getting that kind of, uh... speed and, uh, consistency with your connectivity. That's pretty good. Right now, I think I got, like, 50 megabits per second, and, uh, 5 upload in megabits per second. It's not... It's not bad, but... The problem is, for this ISP, that's bad. Because <laughs> they're not really consistent in their delivery of service. They're a bunch of shit. And we've had these guys for like, years. It was only recently that we upgraded too, because uh, we added one more to the family, which is a cousin, you know. But uh, yeah, their delivery on their service isn't quite up this, up the snow. I'm kind of getting depressed thinking about it because we've been with these guys for so fucking long and they keep offering subpar service. But it's not really my call to make anyways, and that's why it kind of sucks. I just got to deal with this and yell at them as much as I can so they keep everything up to date. No, it's not Xfinity. It's a, it's a local ISP service called Broadstripe. It used to be uh, Millennium Digital Media or some crap like that. But yeah, we've, we've had them since both iterations, so... We've been a long, old customer of theirs. What the fuck is Windstream? Oh my god. <laughs> what is that? What is... What do you power your internet with? Wind? Uh, how, how subpar service? If only there weren't. Uh, it's... We live on the East Coast, so we're not even gonna get any, like, chances of Google Fiber or anything like that either. I mean, we don't need that, technically. I mean, that seems overkill for us here in this household, but it would be fucking nice. Would be pretty neatos, but nah. Like, just anything else besides 
Broad Street would be nice at this point. Yeah, at least you're uh, breathing and stuff. That's pretty good. Hopefully life isn't dragging you down or anything either. Uh, you? God damn it, my need for organizing. Fuck. Ah, I gotta, I gotta put everything in the right boxes. Oh my god. Beans. Where do you even get these from? Oh, I don't know. Three years. <laughs> I don't know, at least you got an estimate. If, it, if, like, fiber came to here in the East Coast, it'd be like, I'd be dead by the time that even happens, because the infrastructure here on, like, Maryland, as far as I know, it's not really that good. Like, it might as well be classified as awful. <laughs> but I don't know. I haven't really been keeping up with the uh, news here either, so maybe it might be coming over here, who knows. But yeah, maybe in the same time frame as yours, but probably, probably not that quick. <laughs> oh nice! That's cool. On a roll. I'm assuming you're still in high school redeemed. Florida. Jesus. <laughs> Hopefully you don't get a uh, don't get all the crazies around you. I've heard stories about Florida. <laughs> oh nice junior. I see. Cool. Well, it sounds like you've been doing good for yourself. That's cool. Ooh, what's this? Dagger. Oh. I was wondering where my pickaxe was. zombie attack I don't know nothing about that but I've heard stories about Florida in general <laughs> you live in a crazy state <laughs> but the when you mean Miami zombie attack do you mean the crocodile infested or crocodile drugged people I know something about that I know about crocodile that shit fucks you up like what is anyone even gonna do with a necrotic drug what the fuck Wait, redeem, do you mean? I don't know anything about Flacca, but that sounds terrifying. <laughs> God damn. Jesus Christ, man. Do you live in Georgia or Florida? I'd say Jacksonville is in a little pocket in Georgia. Oh, so you're near Georgia, but you live in Florida. I don't, I barely, like, it's been so long since I, uh, recited my states. So, <laughs> I keep forgetting where, where, what place is. <laughs> oh. Hmm, okay. Interesting. Yeah, I don't live anywhere near you. Sort of. It'd be like maybe 12 hours of a drive if I went to Florida. But I still don't know the uh, surrounding area anyway, so <laughs> even then it wouldn't matter. Yeah, well, at least I know that Florida and Georgia are kind of together. I guess. Ouch. 
Ah, oh, dude, what happened? You sound like you were doing okay. Like, was this before you made the auto roll? Or after? If it's after, that, that sounds like it pretty much sucked. <laughs> Oh, Redeem, you better be careful about our school. You gotta be very sure that you want to go there, because, uh... The way I... The way I've heard about art schools is that... They can help, but only if you've got the budget... And you've already, like... Kind of solidified yourself as an artist of some sort, you know? Like, you already know the ropes and stuff, and you know how to take criticism and stuff. People go to art school and think, Oh, I'm gonna learn so much, I'm gonna be awesome, and then... They kind of get trashed because they can't take the criticism or anything. They don't have an open mind to learn. So you got to be careful with art school. Where, where am I? What is this? Ah! Fatality. Oh my god, a fine art school. Yeah. Be especially careful then. <laughs> Oh, wait a minute. So when you mean fine arts, do you mean like performing arts or? Because it sounds like when you say audition that you gotta do like a song or something or you have an instrument. Oh, man, that D issue sounds like a problem, damn. Fuck. Do you go to a public school or something? Teachers skip so much. Take tests or miss. God damn. What the fuck? What an awful system we have. <laughs> oh. Wonderful paper. Oh man, I'm gonna fucking make a shit ton out of that. Christ. Oh. So, what do you do? Are you like. Oh. Oh, okay. So, drawing still. Relax. It still counts. Oh, okay. Interesting. Oh, there's another deer over there. Oh my. What do you intend to do, Redeem? Do you intend to sing something or draw something? <laughs> I used to play the trumpet a long time ago, but I wouldn't. E I shouldn't even say play because I didn't actually technically was able to play it. <laughs> I just kind of mimicked, mimicked the fingering, and that's it. Then we can do anything. <laughs> but I still have the trumpet downstairs. All that's missing is a mouthpiece. Where'd you go? Oh, oh he's dead. Ouch. God damn, what the fuck? What the fuck happened to your school? What the hell? That's awful. Christ. Well, at least... At least you care about your school. Like, a lot of people in my high school barely gave a shit about education. A lot of people tend to do that anyways. Not just my school, but yeah. At least you care. Oh, oh, that sucks, damn. Shit, dog. Well, well, usually what my mom says is, one door closes, another one opens, but you can always take a window. That ad part was one of my things, but, you know, whatever, yeah. <laughs> you make your own opportunities, too. So, if you miss this one, or this one you can't get a chance to get, then, you know, there's gonna be other ones to go to. Just gotta keep an open mind. Make sure you're taking care of yourself. Uh, let's see. Armor. Oh. Hey, what, what else did I need? Mm, not even that. Oh, wait, no. Sounds like a school ploy when they when you say it like that. Or when you say that, more like. That's. That's more correct. 
Ah, oh, 3.2, yeah. That's pretty good. Remember to always keep... Uh, remember to always give yourself a foundation, too. Some people will just focus on one thing and then forget everything else. But you gotta learn how to take care of yourself before you start pursuing your own dreams, you know? Some people seem to forget that. What am I doing? Oh, okay. <laughs> Sounds like you'll get it. Hard work always goes a long way. You sound pretty close enough as it is. I wasn't a, uh... I didn't have a 4.0 or... Anything like that when I was high school. I think I was like a 3.2. More or less. I don't remember. Fuck, it's been so long. <laughs> I kind of fucked myself over though when I got in college because, uh... I kind of had it easy trying to understand the material when I was in high school. And then, like, I just forgot how to study and shit, so... It kind of fucked me over when I got into college. <laughs> like, shit. How do I learn this? I don't remember how to... I don't remember how to study here anymore. It was that and, a uh, Giant side of laziness. <laughs> it's like, people think that, uh... Going to college will help you, but it... It's a lot more important to know what you're going to get out of college. Like you don't, you shouldn't go if you don't know what you want. And that's kind of what happened to me. I was like, I didn't know where else to go, but I was like, oh, I guess I'll go to college. Kind of wasted my parents' money, and then it's like, all right, well, I'm out now. I don't know how to quite adapt myself to this current uh, climate of jobs and shit. So I'm just kind of here being an idiot still. <laughs> Oh. Come on. Oh. It's not dead. It's not dead. Did you die? Oh. Oh, there you go. Oh, that hurt. Oh, jeez. It sounded like you had a really tough time in your old house. Got your belly! <laughs> 2.0. Uh, I wasn't that dumb when I was in college. But, yeah. I mean, whatevs. Double neat. Yeah. That's a pretty noble, uh, profession there. Or, not a profession. Well, it is a profession. That's not what I wanted to say. I can't remember. I don't know what I wanted to say. But yeah, that's, that's pretty noble of you to want to go into that kind of field. That's what I meant to say. That kind of field. Yeah. Yeah, I've heard stories about uh, welfare and child care services. Not a lot of it were good. Also, uh, supporting the f thoughts from like SVU and all that doesn't help any either. So yeah, pretty cool. Hopefully you'll get to it. Sounds like you've got the kind of head for that. little love tap. Sure. Love tap. <laughs> love tap from the fist of God. It's hammer time on that shit. Hmm. There's a house. Oh. I'm actually out of here to find, like, iron and stuff, but, uh, I'll get down I'm gonna find it here. I thought I saw something in the shrubbery. Scrap metal. Okay. Here's a house. There's some metal stuff.
Yeah, that's always a funny thing. Like, people want to, people like, build themselves up and then go, I want to go somewhere else away from here. And then they'll encounter three things. Like, one, okay, it's all they dream that their new place would be. Two, oh, it's just as shitty as the place I originally left. Or three, it's way worse. And now I'm stuck here. <laughs> like you only you only got so much so many options sometimes. But going going away for greener pastures, it's like why can't you just help cultivate the land here, you know? It's like it's kinda like human nature. It's constantly fucked us over too. Just learning from history and other people's experiences and just reading on what's happened in the past with like water problems and all that. We still have those water problems, too. It's like, if it's gonna get bad here or in one place, it's... it could happen to the, another place. It's like, you can't expect it to be, like, all sunshine and daisy sometimes. I think people keep constantly forget that. I don't know. I'm just shutting anyways. Ow, cactus. God damn it. California. Oh, <laughs> Jesus Christ. Yeah, people leave. There's no one to help the current local area. I know, I see what you mean. Yeah, I understand and I respect that too. But California, seriously? People, even people who live in California probably don't like California. <laughs> At least in some places. Like, it, it's got its own share of problems. It's not like all the problems will disappear, so your friends are weird. <laughs> Just, just moving into a different place is not going to curtail any problems. They might even find more, like I mentioned before. Whatever, Jesus. Sometimes you just can't help it, but jeez. Yeah. Pretty noble you to just stick around and try and make things better. Hopefully that kind of life treats you well. Because some things, just caring so much sometimes it's an uphill battle. I hope you don't lose that kind of, uh, passion in you. Like, here in Maryland, we got- we got our own share of problems, too. Like, if it isn't the, uh, rent that's high, or the mortgages, or the real estate that's, like, problematic in pricing or something like that, it's the infrastructure, and how Maryland, for some reason, has, like, a very stubborn mindset when it comes to change. Because I see it everywhere. I'm like the most technological guy in this house, so, yeah, it's kind of hard to feel like anything's moving, because everyone seems to say the same. Well, tap. Oops. Tap. Oh, nice. Fucking clipped through me and I couldn't hit him. Alright, no, I'm bleeding now. Alright. Okay, dokie. Uh. Yeah, pretty much redeemed. Um, Seven Days to Die is a zombie survival horror. Uh, what else can I say about it? Well, they're made by the fun pimps. There's, uh, skills and quests that's still in production, though. They're gonna build on that later. And then there's a map. You can put waypoints. There's your character here. You can equip items. They have a grade system for the items, too. Like, orange is poor, green is good, and etc., etc. What do you mean by the old way? Oh yeah, Maryland, yeah. Old ways. <laughs> yeah, they're, they're, Maryland seems, from my perspective, it's stubborn to change. We still got, uh, like, varying problems of, like, past and future. Uh, I'll just... Wait, I didn't know that? Yeah, I did. What? Okay, never mind. 
yeah, um, DC, Maryland's a state, DC is a, uh, city here. Good old capital of the uh, United States. Wait, no it's not. Technically our capital is Annapolis, but, uh, yeah, no one really cares. <laughs> Yeah, I don't blame you. Like I mentioned before, I had problems trying to figure out where uh, Georgia was. I didn't know it was so close to Florida. <laughs> Ooh, stag. Yeah, this game is kind of like Rust. You can build stuff, you can survive. There are options that are provided to the player, whether when a person dies that they can drop everything, delete everything, or only drop their tool belt, which is what you see at the bottom there on the screen. So yeah, it's just kinda like Rust. Might as well be identical to Rust. Except uh just just minus the zombies. <laughs> no, whatever. I mean I enjoy this game. I like it. I like what the uh devs are doing so far. Aside from some things, but yeah. Ah, that is true, Redeem. Yeah, Maryland's kind of like that. But still, man. I mean, it's fine to... It's fine to preserve history, but... We don't need this kind of preser preservation, you know what I mean? <laughs> it's like... We're preserving history so much, we're gonna show you... How it was like to live here in Maryland. In old Maryland, where the rent is high and... Job economy's poor, it's like... Uh, no, that's too historical. I don't want to be immersed that bad. <laughs> Just show me a museum. Or take me to a museum. Fuck that. <laughs> Though, just take my, uh, my experiences with Grand Salt. Because I am a shut-in. I barely go outside. The only thing I got is the news to relay information to me and just let me think and reflect on things. But, I mean, I lived here my entire life, so... Hopefully I know something about the damn place, you know? <laughs> they would kind of fucking suck to be like, Oh, I... Turns out I don't know fucking shit about this... State that I've lived in for my entire life. Oh, that's fucking nice. <laughs> oh, yeah, that reminds me. I went to a museum in Virginia with my friends before. We saw tanks... World War II army equipment, it was nice. Good old, good old military museums, if I remember right. Pretty cool, pretty cool. I even have a, uh, screen sh screenshot, it's not a fucking screenshot. I even have a picture of a tank as my, uh, phone wallpaper. <laughs> so yeah, that was an enjoyable place, I learned a lot. Like your PC. Oh, man. Oh, 30 FPS. That's pretty nice. I mean, compared to most people's PCs, like... <laughs> yeah, it's like... You can only ask for so much sometimes, you know? Ah. <laughs> it seems like sometimes like, going out is a luxury, but I just naturally don't like to go outside. This is not who I am. Yeah, I mean, it's hard to not hear about Prince's death. It's all over. Like, I usually keep Twitter up 24-7. So I get a lot of news quicker than most people. Because, you know, it's easy to just link somebody. Which is kind of a whole nother dilemma in itself, but, uh, yeah. I'm not gonna talk about that. I didn't really, uh... Prince wasn't really a big part of my life, so it's like, oh, it sucks, you know. An iconic, uh, singer or person died. Like, yeah, uh, that sucks. But, you know, yeah, life goes on. The only song I know about Prince is, uh, is, a uh, guitar song. <laughs> as far as I know, Redeemed, history has got no boundaries. Like, a lot of people, it's like... I don't know if you know how uh, Germany or Japan works, but they constantly censor their history. Like, I don't feel like that's a good thing, but it's obviously out of my control and I have no say in it. But it's important to know the good and the bad of every every country's history. 
you know? It's like a humbling thing, because sometimes when you just only focus on the good things, you think that the only thing that a country or a person can do is good. It's like, no. Nah, don't even, don't idolize a damn thing. Respect them, but don't idolize them. Oh god, League of Legends. Eh, I'm not gonna crap on you for that. I used to play League of Legends. I usually mained at Ziggs. I was pretty good at him too, like, being able to bounce around and shit, but, uh, yeah, it just kind of got to the point where me and my friends were like, yeah, we can't really deal with this abuse anymore. Because we can't, we, we constantly went through, like, bad shifts of people, or we lost, and it was like, oh, God, no more. Wait, who was the other singer that died? I think I missed that. I know about Prince's death, but, uh, I don't know if... Oh, Michael Jackson. Wait. How did it... Did, didn't Michael Jackson die from, like, a drug overdose? The only thing I heard from Prince's death was that he died. There wasn't any, uh, indication of how he died, so... Did Prince die from an overdose, too? <laughs> Shit, that sucks. If that is the case. And yeah, well, at least you're aware of that redeemed. It seems like a lot of people seem to lack, like, worldliness to them. Like, they got a fucking computer in their hands, or just access to the internet. It's like, aren't you curious about how the world is out there sometimes? Which is funny when it comes from me, because, you know, yeah, we're both shut-ins. <laughs> like, okay, well, I mean, that shouldn't inhibit you. <laughs> Ah, uh, chances are redeemed. Me and my friends are probably never going to touch League of Legends again. Right now, we're kind of hooked on Heroes of the Storm, so that's our uh, that's our guilty pleasure for the time being. <laughs> oh, I see redeemed. Okay, damn, damn, it's eerily scary. Ah, uh, I see. Okay, yeah, that that's it's eerie. <laughs> And a lot of people have been dying since the beginning of 2016. David Bowie and Alan Rickman. It's like, fuck, give us a break. That's usually what happens. Just... Ugh. Hammer time. Just how the world goes, I guess. Sadly. <laughs> Christ. Like, I wonder who's next sometimes. It's like, there's a lot of celebrities that even died. Like, in this past year. It's like, Christ. Oh. Well, if it's on the news, then it should be... Should be... Truthful enough. <laughs> oh, yeah, I did hear about that little tidbit redeemed of the five, uh, man cues. Not that it affects me, but, yeah. News usually gets around when I, uh, check on Twitter. Kind of hard for me to miss, like, small or big changes about any game. Because of Twitter. Christ. <laughs> Ooh. 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 That's nice. Oh, crit to get gas in me. Yeah, Blizzard's been uh, kind of shitting it lately. Sucks, but I don't know. Yeah, especially with the Nostralia server, I think it was called. I'm, I'm, I know I'm close, but like, fuck, that was awful. Yeah, rest in peace, Snape, or rather, Alan Rickman, whatever, whichever you want. <laughs> I really hate this Twitch delay sometimes. <laughs> I can't have a conversation with people who are watching if we can't even be on one consistent plane, goddammit. Ah. Good shit. <laughs> Fun with ragdolls. Got in trouble? Trouble no more. <laughs> okay. 
right now. The place where we perched ourselves in this game, this whole place is an island. Like, we got two connecting roads here. I will probably have to make camp soon. Maybe. I don't really feel like it, but I'm okay for now. I keep wandering as far as I want to. Oh. Yeah, get out of here. Well, there's a little lake in case anything happens. Be okay to set up here. I got all the tools I need. Uh, yeah, let's set up here. This is a good place to set up base. Deep blowing. As soon as I get the wood. Don't follow me. Oh yeah, that's a funny thing. Uh, the trees didn't do this before. They didn't topple over like you saw. Uh, at one point when they added that in, like before, the trees just disappeared. They didn't do anything. But when they added the ability for the trees to fall, keep in mind, they can kill you when they do that. But when they added in that feature, sometimes the trees would insta-kill you. Like, you wouldn't even see the animation before you died. They That was actually a bug, and they had to patch that out. <laughs> so now... You can get out of the way, you can see the tree fall before getting crushed to death. It's hilarious. <laughs> uh, oops. Let's see. Four. I want four. Yeah, four is good. All I need is a platform. Might need more, but uh, I will. We will take that as it comes. What form? Oh, there you go. I can uh, destroy this. Yeah, you are right. I mean, there is, there are optional. Yeah, there are other options too, like a uh, Beam Pro. That's a pretty good site, as far as I've seen. And there's also Hitbox, which is okay, but you know, there are options. Unfortunately, Twitch is too big for itself, so, yeah, I mean, it might be, who knows, years before you even see some healthy competition with these guys. Fifteen seconds on godly internet. Damn. Ah, uh, bit great. Well, Redeem, no stream delay... Er, no delay streams do exist, but uh, yeah, Beam Pro does that fine with their uh, new technology, but they aren't big enough to uh, give Twitch a run for their money yet. But I do support them, and I do think they what they're doing is cool. Oh, crazy! Hang on, let me just adjust my chair. <laughs> Fuck! Oh, that food that I had like an hour ago is still swimming in my belly. Yeah, you can plant trees, but uh, it's not that easy, unfortunately. <laughs> it would be nice, but no, it's not that easy. But yeah, you can plant trees. They take a while to grow, though, so even then it would still wouldn't be good. To try and kill them with, at least. A little platform there. Oh, no! Oh. Oh yeah, um, I don't know if you saw what happened or noticed what happened, but uh, basically there is physics in this game. So things can fall if you don't support them, which that is what exactly happened. I need to. Yeah, yeah, Twitch is worth billions. Sadly. <laughs> now your mileage might vary. Okay, this one. There's two. Yeah. We'll see what happens. The future is unknown, and forever will it be. 
Some people take solace in that, other people for some reason do not, but I am not one to argue their mindset. This, uh, uh yeah, okay. And Christ, I can build fast. No! Oh, God damn it, I gotta do the sides too. Fuck. This platform will rise again. Yeah, but this time it won't rise in the south, it'll rise in the north. Because that's the elevation I'm building it on. Mark my words. Frames. How many frames can I build? Oh my god, I got a lot of fucking wood from that one tree. Alright, I'm gonna need a lot of wood. All this for a little outpost, Christ. Oh, I got a problem with this game. <laughs> The problem is, I need more material. Right. Will you hold now? Will you hold now? Yes, you will. Because I measured it out already on one side. But what about this side? Okay, let's see. There's... Kidding me? Well, fuck that then. Huh. Oops. Oh, thank God I can do that. Okay, I don't know. Uh, if you notice right here with these wood frames, this is basically a skeleton that you can make. The way you solidify their positions is by upgrading them, which I'll show you. Uh, show you in just a little bit. Let me just do this first. All right, there you go. There is a good platform there. In case any wanderbys decide to need a break and they can just bunk here for the night. <laughs> Even though it doesn't have a roof over their head or anything like that, but it's still a lot better than sleeping on the fucking ground. There's crickets and grasshoppers and whatever crawls through what on the ground. <laughs> Actually, I guess I'll show you while I'm doing this. Okay, so this is a repairing tool or a salvaging tool. Basically, you right-click on something, and there you go. When I place these stairs, they're already solidified, so I wouldn't be able to move them even if I wanted to, so I had to place them carefully. But for these wood frames, you can just pick them up if you decide you made a mistake or something like that. Since I didn't, I'm going to solidify them in their place. So now I can't pick them up anymore. <laughs> Technically. Yeah, technically it is. There's like a giant horde that usually spawns every seven days. And uh, if you're not well prepared for it, you usually can get fucked over. Oh, I should also mention, this game has like two modes of zombies. One mode is that during nighttime, they go what you would call feral. And they are able to sprint slash run at you. There's also an option to just make them feral all the fucking time. I don't know what crazy fucker would want to do that, but that is not the server. In this server, they're always set to walk, so they're like normal zombies. Uh, yeah, this will this will be a uh, this will be what I call a resting station. So anyone who comes on this side here, they can find this place. I'll light a I'll make a beacon of some sort, and then. Ooh, I'm getting hungry. Yeah. They'll be able to rest here, resupply, or do whatever the hell they need to do to get ready. Okay. Uh, I have doubts about that middle center. And yes, this is online multiplayer. You can play with friends, you can just jump into a server. If you know how Rust and, uh... Ark, or... I think there was another game that did it too. I don't remember. But if you know those games, then you'll pretty much more or less understand this game. Every server works in a its own way. So you'll have to be starting anew with every server you jump into. Which isn't bad. I mean, they made it a lot. 
a lot easier to deal with stuff. Build straight up. If you want, yeah. I mean, like, go fuck ahead. <laughs> Nothing is stopping you from building anything. But, uh, yeah, I don't want to build up because I don't want to die on that like, giant boner pillar alone. That would not be conducive to my health. Oh, sham ham. I'm gonna have to take down another tree. Come here, buddy. Oh, what's under the tree? Nothing. Absolutely nothing. Yeah, if you played Ark, then you know you'll know how this game works when it comes to online. So, pretty cut and dry with in that regard. Oops. Oop. How many do I need? Let's see. Two, four, six, eight, twelve. It seems slow paced right now, but uh Oh, yeah, redeem. There is a there is hunger. There is uh there's a survival system. So you see right here in the player stats, this is my food percentage, this is my water percentage, pretty cut and dry. There's also a temperature and weather system. So right now my current body temperature is 65 degrees Fahrenheit. So if that gets too high, you'll get some debuffs. It won't kill you outright, but yeah. In terms of living forever, yeah, you could, if you survive, but, uh... If you die, like I mentioned before earlier, if you die, the server will, uh, respond with a different setting. So, depending on the server, you can lose all your stuff, and you have to go get it, or just outright deletes everything that you have in your inventory, and you gotta start off fresh. Your stats, however, like your skills and stuff, they'll probably be persistent. I don't think I noticed an option where they get reset when you die. But yeah, you could technically live forever. But, uh, it gets harder with every day that passes. Or every, uh, seven days that passes. So, it ramps up. Like, since I'm early on these days, which technically isn't true, since resetting a server for some reason resets the days, but on the seventh day, you get a, you get a horde. It's not bad, because of my experience, but if you're not prepared for it, you'll get fucked up. But, on, let's say, the 21st day, there are zombies that spew and shoot, like, acid, and there are these really hardy military zombies that are tough to kill, and then there's, like, a horde of dogs that go after you, and these giant mutated hornets that sting you, and they get up close and sting you. It's like, it gets crazy with every every seven days which is why it's called seven days to die oh oh man who would have known oh, sorry <laughs> minecraft logic whatever what ever er er shit i'll uh, just fix this i think I think you can die from hunger. I've just never bothered to try. <laughs> that is why I do not know. Because, you know, I want to live, and I want to live with good, good stats, so yeah. <laughs> uh, hmm. Wait, iron. Oh. Oh, well, I fucked that up. Iron, right, just scrap it. Shouldn't have done that. <laughs> um, let's see. How do we do this? Oh, I didn't bring any. Uh... Oh, that's a problem. I did not bring any torches, so I can't even mark the site. 
Whoa, fuck. That's some tough shit. Crap. Ah. Okay, well, I guess I'll just make a campfire. Oh, uh-oh. Um, just put this here. Don't fucking... God damn it, dirt. Oh, are you fucking serious? Not dead yet. There you go. Fucking ruining my goddamn building, you know. Came here to help my living buddies, not you. I know I saw another zombie. There he is. Oh, I missed. There you go. Alright. Now, I know where to get some fat, which I'll need. Not like that. Come on. Let me have a sad body. Okay, I didn't get what I needed from that. Alright. I am not getting what I need. Alright. No, that's not what I wanted to do. For the love of fucking Christ, I just need some fat. Oh. One solitary piece. One a singular piece. I uh, hear more zombies. Oh. Ooh. That was a Disney death. Except now it's not. Oops. Uh, nah. Paper. I don't really need that right now. Oh, that's definitely something I don't need from this. I just bought my animal fat. He said goodbye so many times before. Did I... Of course I didn't get it again. Of course. God damn it. Go fuck me like that. What else do I need? Hallow cloth fragment. Oh, okay. Do I even have access to... Oh, fuck. Okay, well, I don't have access to that either. I guess I'll just make the uh, wrong menu. Garage. I got too much stuff on me, so I gotta drop it. Make a, uh... uh, let's see. Dump all this off. I guess I'll deal with it later. Oops. Take care of yourself, Redeem. Thanks for watching, man. Have a good night, and have good dreams. Streamy, dreamy. <laughs> uh, oh, no, I need that. Okay. That is. Sideways and call me Mary. Doesn't make any sense. Anyway, I've been on third day this whole time. Oh my god! Don't kill me!
Oh fuck, I've been playing for an hour? I didn't even notice that. That's funny. <laughs> Time goes by when you're chatting and playing. Shit. Mm, it looks like night's coming. Hopefully I don't hear a silent group of dogs coming up from behind me or some shit like that, because that's a bunch of bullshit. Sadly, it's happened before. So fucking dark. Even the captors think it's a dark. It's like, fuck, I can't even see anything. Let me just record the blackness. Oh, that's good. Ah, oh, this is wasting so much scrap. Damn it. That's a weird bug. For some reason, sometimes when I switch out from the window or the game menus, I can't seem to use my wrench right to upgrade anything. Don't know why. That's a weird problem. Hmm. It might be. Sorry, I thought I heard something. I might be close to calling it. This is one of my uh, famous razzling dazzling short streams. An hour. Jesus. You know, I've watched live streams that stream for like six hours straight. Good for fucking you. Jesus. Oh wow, that was quick. <laughs> Good timing. The other thing I'm worried about is the uh, pillars here. I'm gonna reinforce them in particular. If anything happens to them, the entire platform goes down. This may not have been a good idea in hindsight. But I've made this bed and now I'm gonna lie in it. This hard wooden bed of mine. One, there's one uh, block I'm still missing, but I can't see it and get to it. <laughs> so that's going to have to stay as is. Alright, looking good. Now, if only I had enough, uh, if we just had any torches. If there was, like, a Ooh, gas, sorry. Hang on. Oh, let me just take a drink. If there was a source of coal around here, this would uh, be a little bit easier, but it's not. Oh, even for the candle, need towel. Fuck. Um. Let's see. How big is this? Two. Uh, three, four, five, six, seven. Seventeen plus seventeen, 
32. 34. 34 plus... Oh, fuck math. Okay, I'll just make 34 start. No, uh oh, my food's gone. Ah, uh, well, that causes. It's gonna be a problem. Hmm. Where, oh, where could I find. Like, a pig or. I usually name my outposts in a uh, NATO alphabet. Trans okay. Kiak. It's GM for Grim Meteor. Ho, ho, ho. This is not the time to shill, and I won't. <laughs> oh shit. Oh yeah. Um. These these uh these frames that I'm making. Just in general, the more experienced your character is with building and stuff, the faster they'll be made. So right now, usually. Making these amount of frames probably takes a little bit if you're starting off, but as time goes on and you uh, skill up that particular skill, it'll be a lot quicker. Oh. Oh my, I made too many. Oops. Ow. Oh, man. Sometimes I wish I was a math Asian. At least that stereotype seems flattering, even though I know in hindsight, or more like in foresight, it is not. <laughs> but yeah, anyways, let's see. No, it's not looking for. Uh. Oh, hang on, I gotta scratch my body. My body. Outer. The inner? Oh, it's a full corner. Oops. One, two. Hmm. Oh, I can't even scrap them. Fuck. Oops. Oh, thank God I can take them out. Jesus. All this to build a little outpost. Man, a lot of work goes into everything. Fuck. Uh, let's see. Two. One, two. Eight. I don't know what I'm going to do with these uh, ramps now that I made them, but I might as well just throw them in the box. Okie dokie. What do you need to... Oh god, military fiber, shit. Can you make military fiber? I'm assuming that's from something else. And I do not have the uh, ability to do that yet. If at all. There you go. There you go. Make this nice and symmetrical. Cool. Alright. Oops. Well, now that I've done that, I gotta make everything symmetrical. Fuck. Oh, why? It's like a ghost smith, just hammering away. Ooh, spooky! How does this platform get here? Ooh! Black as night! No one knows! Ooh! God damn it. Uh, 
Alright, for symmetrical... For the sake of symmetry, I'm just up with these two and that's it. Hopefully I don't do the same fucking mistake to anything else. All this iron was meant to go to my forges, but I decided, no, I'm gonna explore and make an outpost here and there. It would have been way better if I just took an abandoned house and made a little outpost up top in the attic or something like I did with the outpost gamma. Nope, I had to be fucking stubborn. God damn it. Is this outpost even gonna be able to weather a horde or anything? I should, should be safe, you know. The spoiler is that it won't. No one's gonna fucking come here to survive. They're gonna come here to give a checkpoint for themselves and then go. I really need a claw hammer. The problem with the claw hammer is that uh, it can't disassemble things. It's not a salvaging tool as far as I know. Which is kind of strange, but okay. It's like the claw, the claw hammer is like strictly meant for upgrading, that's it. That seems like a waste of time. Ah, fuck. I just wear my helmet since it's daytime. Hey, man. Oh, fighter of the night, man. Oh, champion of the sun. Oh, you're the master of karate. Oh. Sorry. <laughs> These big rocks around me, I hate them so damn much. They don't have as much iron that I could get from a actual boulder. And that seems like an oversight, because these fuckers are everywhere. Like, fuck you, I don't want to get fucking iron from you. You don't even yield that much. Why would I mine you? Christ. They're like... It's like... You're so fucking haughty, being all made out of stone more than anything else. Like, fuck you. Oh, coal, thank Christ. Oh, I get so much too. Nice. Oh, I'm just... I'm just orgasming. Oh my god, there's so much coal. Oh, there's so many torches. Sorry. <laughs> Sorry. Oop, shit. That's... Those are cement blocks. Alright. Alright, th this area here is what you would call the wasteland. Because it was wasted. <sighs> Sorry. <laughs> the bright side is that there's a lot of ruined stuff here, so that also counts for stone, which is the cement block you see around you. And these ruined, uh... The... Uh, steel beams. For a second there, I almost forgot what they were called. And I was like, please don't. Brain, please don't. And, uh... If anyone's curious, yes, you can check the toilets. Usually you find poop or murky water. Useful in their own right. I'm not sure about the poo, though. Maybe... Really... Try to smear it all of yourself, I don't know. Just smear it all up. Just eat it, maybe. I don't, I don't know. Do whatever you want. Car? Oh, nice. I guess. I mean, it's wasteland, so it wouldn't be nice at all. <laughs> ah, fuck. God damn it. Oh, I, I can find sand here. Oh. That's gonna be useful, too. I didn't know that. That's strange. Oh, God. I'm just a harvesting machine. Fucking shove it onto my goddamn gullet, you fuck. something on my foot. It... It's a scorpion! No, it's not. Oh, there's so much dirt and shit on the floor here in the house. Ugh. Oh, football helmet. Just grab that. Oh. Ah, damn. I forgot to check something with that. 
Uh, there should be another one around here, I guess. Yep. Hang on, adjust the mic. Oh, I just want to slouch a little bit. <laughs> uh, can you? Oh. Can you make it? Oh, you used to be able to just snag the cooler and uh, use it as a furniture item, but I guess I'm gonna remove that because you're poop. Yeah, that's okay. Locker? Oh. Nope. else? What else do I need here? Um. Well, there is uh, animal hide and stuff, but uh, I'm gonna need a lot of that, so fuck that. This is a goddamn outpost, not a full-fledged base. Yeah, settle down. Oh, no. There you go. More brass. Yeah, let me just check these uh, cars and then mine that one, uh, one bowler. Then I'm gonna go back. Off. Okay. All right. Wrap my head around that. What did I love? Oh, I did. Ah, oh, I forgot about that. Oops. Da -da -da. as much of this fucking shit that I can carry. Where is it? Oh. I almost lost track. I was getting iron hungry. Such a lust for iron. Ooh! 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 Fuck. Goddamn memes up in here. Fuck me. Just destroy me. Erase my existence from the world. Oh, out of man. I, I I already said it. Fuck, I said mana. God damn it. I meant stamina. God damn it. Oh. There you go. Peekaboo! I see you! Oh, nice. He had food. Cool. Alright. Time to continue with this. Oh, I still might not even have enough. Fuck! Fraud, drummer. I'll see. You know how far the travel for all this? A million goddamn miles. You will enjoy this fucking trip, and you will like it. That was redundant. God damn it. Of course it'd be redundant. I'm just full of redundancies. My life existence was redundant. All right, there we go. All fortified and good to go. Just throw more fucking stuff in that and that. Oh, I need that. I will need that. I actually will need that. Okay. Hmm, that's not what I meant. Ugh. Man, who can even stomach a whole can of sh sham ham? Like, fuck. That must be awful. All that sodium? Fuck, your arteries will just seize up. They'll fucking do a. F like, the goddamn Charleston behind dubstep music. Ugh. It's like, Jesus. I can just feel my arteries clogging up just thinking about it. Oh, shit. Well, I guess I'm gonna die on stream, sorry. Fan me if you want. <laughs> I know in a certain streaming service that is like prohibited. 
Like, you can't be drunk on stream. You can't die on stream. Like, they specifically say that in the terms of service, I think. I've only heard this through hearsay, but if that's true, it's like, okay. Like, you can't fucking help to die. It's like, I could be perfectly fine. Hang on. I gotta swallow my green tea. <laughs> you can be perfectly fine and stream perfectly fine, and then, oh no, someone stabbed you, you're dying on stream. It's like, oh, I get banned for this? Like, you gonna, you want a pissed off ghost so bad? Jesus. It's so weird. This is only if it's true. I'm not really sure if it's true, but that would be fucking funny. But I guess, you know, they don't expect things like that to happen. But you never know what could happen in this weird, strange world of instantaneous communication and... Not socialism, but mass social communication. Ow, my jaw just cracked. Fuck. This goddamn bruxism will be the end of me. But yeah, anyways. Oh, I didn't need to put that back. Because I am going to make this. Oh, that should be enough. I shouldn't have put this here. I'm going to have to make a new one. Fuck. At least it's not that much material loss. Can't fire. Oh, I actually intended to put that here. The, uh... The, uh... Signal pillar is what I... What I call it. So people know something's there. Like, oh, hey, look. Some sort of, uh, refuge. Oh, shit, oh, no! Oh, good boy, you jumped. underneath that's funny Zombie dogs, these guys are fucking stupid. Like, they're still stupid. You can sometimes barely hear them coming. And I just don't know why. Like, before before you even know they're coming, they've, they're have they already on you. Like, it's too late to run away. They'll stun you, they'll daze you, and then that'll be it. Just get fucking mobbed up by zombie dogs. I hate these. I hate these zombies. So... They're... They're unfair in the meta sense. Like, they just don't give you any telegraphing. And then, there's like no running away once they get you. Like, it's stupid. But... It can also apply to the normal zombies too. Like, sometimes they don't... You don't know they're coming. Even if I wasn't listening to music or anything, and I've tested this, I can sometimes... Or rather, no, not even sometimes. Most of the times, I can barely hear them coming up behind me. It's like they just spawn there somewhere or something. It's like it's really fucking annoying. But this game is in, I think, early access still. So I don't know. I mean, hopefully they'll change that. But for the time being, since it's, this game has been around for quite some time, they haven't yet, and I don't expect them to, sadly. But yeah, oh bear shit. Oh that'll that'll give me some good uh, material. Hang on. Just put the stupid thing up. As I was doing earlier. I wasn't even measuring this entire platform out. I'm glad everything was symmetrical. Oh Ooh, Jesus, I wanna put Oh yeah, the reason I'm worried is that you could break your leg. You can splint in it too, but uh I don't have a splint with me. I think I had the materials for it, but uh, I'm not sure. I don't wanna take the chance. Oh yeah, there you go. Good old, uh... Oops. Good old outpost mic. So put this, uh... Right here. There you go. Look 
I don't know why I'm riding flesh. I don't want it. And all this stuff in there. No, that hide needs to be there. Let's see. What? Didn't walk away, did it? Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> Don't go glitchy on me, game. Wouldn't be the first time. Pretty sure I saw that bear over here. Bear is not a zombie, by the way. Thankfully. Better be too damn overpowered if it was. I'm gonna run to that bear watch. Did it go over here to take a drink? Is that it? No, that's a car. Hope it didn't go the wrong way. I saw it over here somewhere. There? That was a stump. With nothing in it? Okay. Mm, there's a stag. But no bear. Gonna make me a ham steak out of this one. Except not really, because it's a stag. I don't think it has any ham in it. I am not a cook person or a hunter person. I am more likely to die in a fetal position out in the wilderness than I am to survive, because I'd be too stupid to live. <laughs> I wonder if that bear made its way over here. Nope. Oh, no, it's a pig. Uh, I thought that was the bear. I swear I saw it around here. Uh, I guess I lost it. Where's that pig? Can I see it from here? If I can't see... Oh, there it is. Oh, there's another pig! Can I get it from here? Not too far. Let me get a closer vantage point. Now I'm going to make me some ham steak out of this one. Sizzle, sizzle goes the piggy. Sorry. <laughs> hmm. Where's the other one? Okay. Just need a... Oh. Not oh, missed it. Where are you going? Damn it. Gotcha. Oh, hey, led me to a coal deposit. That's nice. And a bird nest with no eggs. Fuck. Alright, pig, you're gonna pay for that sin. Come here. Gotcha. I wanna cut that deposit. Been alive if the bear's like right near me. <laughs> That'd be hilarious. Nope. Oh, okay. Good. I have a lot of stuff on me. I don't want to lose it. Now, the one thing I hope eventually they'll put just for uh, PVE sake is that we can uh, drop multiple bed rolls or pillows. Not pillows, fuck. Multiple beds to checkpoint ourselves. And if we die, we can just spawn in one of those. That would be nice. But, that's... This is probably not that kind of game, sadly. So, it's probably gonna be, uh... It's probably not gonna happen. It would be nice, just for PvE people like me. Because I don't like playing with, uh... Anyone I don't know, usually. Like, I'm not... I know this game is like more like Rust when it comes to multiplayer and stuff like that, so I'd rather not, uh, I'd rather not have to deal with that. And I'd rather it would be nice if I could just play the way I want and my friends would want. 
But, you know, if not this game, then there's Starbound, which I'm setting for the next patch. That'll be nice. Like, uh, they're, up, they're overhauling the quest system, they're upping combat a bit, they're giving us more materials and furniture and stuff to use, and kind of organizing the tiers of technology. They're giving us mercenaries and updating the lodging system and allowing us to oh that's what I meant allowing us to purchase mercenaries if we're not that kind of guy who would want to uh, manage people or build a civilization or something like that yeah, all the changes all the updates they have next day sound pretty cool hopefully I'll be alive to experience it experience it all ah, I flubbed that line fuck me ah, whatever not like, it's not like I'm awake right now, anyways. Wood pipe. Do I have pipes? Yes, I do have pipes. Great. And wood. Alright, this forge will still be, uh, wanting. Oh, mm, I got fucking clay. God damn it. Of course, I forget one thing. The entire system falls apart. Of course. Okay, besides clay, is there anything else? No, I got everything. Any time. Oh, God, I'll do it. That isn't a mosquito biting on my fucking legs. I'm gonna look at it. It's got smallpox. Am I careful? Oh, nice. Okay. Clay. Fun fancy song. Oh, OC Remix, you're full of mirth and laughter and interest all the time. Oh, fuck, it's getting hotter. God damn it. Oops. Didn't mean to press that. Alright, that's enough. Stash this in here. Uh, once I put this forge down, cook some food, and store it in the uh, bin right there, that'll probably be it for the night. I'm already past uh, 1.30, so this is probably... This is still in short stream territory, sort of. Uh, usually my, my longest... Well, my longest time stream was like six hours, which is like normal for a lot of people on Twitch, but not me, sadly. But yeah, I mean, I could, but I don't want to. Maybe sometime later in my life, but not right now. For now, my highest is usually two to three hours. So by that, by that, uh, calculation... I am reaching almost normal length stream time for myself. Huh. That's pretty good. It's for me. <laughs> it's like, whatever. Like what you want. Hmm. Well, I could throw this in. No other iron based material. Sir. I don't know. Don't tell me that. Fucking mosquito bit my freaking arm. I feel it itchy everywhere, but then again, it might be my poor hygiene. <laughs> I'm gonna. I'm not gonna lie about that. You know, sometimes I have bad hygiene. Who doesn't? I mean, as far as I. As far as I read and stuff, it's not healthy to actually wash every day. Like, not a full wash. If you're. If you're lightly. Uh, lightly. Um, washing yourself with soap then that's okay, but if you're heavily washing yourself every day, or not even heavily washing, if you're just constantly washing yourself every day, you might hurt your skin, in truth, as far as I've read, so. I don't know, it sounds like it's reasonable, though, because, uh, how have we lived this long? Without, uh, showering. Pretty sure we would be dead, like, quicker. If our bodies couldn't handle such dirt and stuff. 
but I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Oh, I need an anvil. Oh, fucking, a fucking anvil. God damn it. I need more allowance, lonely. No, I don't. But I do need an anvil. An anvil. Oh, you know what? I could probably, uh... This place seems fine right now. I could probably just... Go to a car, try and farm for an engine, and then just throw it in there and get 200 iron right off the bat. But, uh... uh that requires more walking. I'm already close. I'm just gonna... Pack up more iron here. This is like the chillest game to play. Like, if I just don't feel like streaming anything else, this usually is my go-to game. Like, not even just streaming, I just enjoy playing this game. It's kind of weird sometimes being able to, or enjoying games like this. It's like, I know a lot of people would be like, this isn't a game, it seems like a work simulator. But then, you know, literally, there are work simulators, so it's like, whatever. I mean, it's like... You can have fun different ways, okay? Like, why well, you gotta complain to people sometimes about how one person's way to play a game is, like, not fun. It's like, okay. Man, everyone has different tastes and shit. I just like being creative, and this game gives me an outlet for that. It's just but one outlet I can have to funnel my creativity in some way. Oh, there's a dog. Is it a horde of dogs? It's a horde of dogs. I'm gonna just shit myself and run. I don't know. I mean, that kind of complaining is weird to me. It's like there's different ways to have fun. You know? I don't know. Don't think that there's only one way, because that's not true. It's not right to believe that. Ah, fuck. Okay, that dog is probably like gone to the sea. Like, literally, I think he just went into the water. I don't know why, but the NPCs do that sometimes, and I'm not sure why. But, I don't see it anymore. Okay. Okie dokie. I'm kind of paranoid now, because I feel like I'm being watched by, like, a, a gang of hounds. They're ready to just bite off my dick at any time. It's like, please don't. Don't do that. You're hard enough to detect as it is. I don't want to, have to deal with this shit. Oh, nice. Let me just add more to that. Clay in there. Alright, that cooking pot is soon. Let's add more shit in here. Oh, corn syrup. Okay. It's quite the calm day. At least when there are no dogs around. I am thankful for that kind of shit. Thought I heard something, but I think it was the music. <laughs> Look at that sky. Such a beautiful sky. Oh, did you sun? Hi, sun. Hello, Mr. Sun. How are you? Looks like you're having a cloudy day today. Well, I hope things get better for you. You never know what's in the future. So that should be liberating. We can carve what we want in that unknown abyss. It'll be okay. <laughs> Sorry. God damn it. Oops. Okay, seriously? God damn it. Uh, oh yeah, cook some meat, do that, do this. And then we'll call it a night. Oops. Mm, 
Oh, Ooh, I can make a lot. Okay. No corn on the cob because I need that corn to make plants and shit later on. Oh, I'm almost, I'm almost level. That's funny. Forged iron. Let's just repair this one here. What? Fragment. Need a lot of cuff. Oh, oh no, there's a screamer. If you don't know what a screamer is, if you don't kill her quick enough, then she'll call in more horde. I do not want that. Let me just repair all my shit first. And not press the scrap button by accident. I wonder if I can hit her from here. Oh, wow. Oh, God. Now I gotta make sure I killed her. God damn it. Are you dead? Oh. Good. Jesus. Eh, it doesn't look like she summoned anything. It's kind of funny, though. If you don't kill her in time and she summons a horde, they just kind of materialize out of the blue. It's kind of a, it's one kind of unsettling, but in the annoying way. <laughs> uh, what was the word I was gonna use? Fuck, I forgot. It's uh, uh I didn't want to say unsett. I didn't want to start with unsettling. It's, it's annoying to see them just materialize out of nowhere. You know. Oh, it's disillusioning too. It's like it, it breaks my suspension of disbelief when they just pop out like that. But I don't know how else they can do that, you know? It's like, I don't think they got any way to just kind of make it look like they just come from behind a boulder or something like that. Because a lot of them spawn, so... If you're in a certain area where there's, like, nothing around you and a screamer comes, it's like, where are they gonna come from? They wanna just, well, pop out of the ground, but it's like, it's weird. <laughs> like, whatever. I'm just gonna... Good old body of this bacon and eggs. And 100. Okie dokie. Get a sip of that, uh... Get a sip of that, uh... Get a sip of that water. <laughs> Sorry. Uh, Sorry. <laughs> Alright. Okay. Well, that's 7 days to die for you. Update patch 14 point something. As far as I know. And yeah. Pretty good. It's way faster than, like, the last time I played. If you're... If you're really, really... Ugh. That didn't sound right to me. If you're really willing to watch part one of this, I know I have it somewhere deep in the trenches of my YouTube and shit, but if you really want to watch that, you can compare how quickly or slowly things have changed. But things have definitely changed for the quicker. So yeah. Where's where's Mr. Sun? I wanna I wanna say goodbye to you. Mr. Sun! He's gone. Okay. Then I am too. So, uh, this is the time where I shill myself. If you want to see more live streams, or other live streams, or other games I've played, I mean. And maybe other cut content, which I've been, uh, lax in putting up. There's my YouTube. If you want to know when to go online, or if you want to just watch someone shit post or not say anything for days on end, there's my Twitter. If you want to ask me questions or anything like that, there's also my, uh, there's also my Tumblr there you can go to, too. If you really want it, so it's whatever. But yeah, I hope you enjoyed what you saw. I hope you enjoyed what... Wait, no. Yeah, I hope you enjoyed what you saw. And take care, have a good night, and I will see you Monday, hopefully. My internet's still being stupid, so I just don't know what'll happen. But yeah, take care.